One thing is immediately apparent about the School of Business and Social Sciences at Aarhus University, and that's its interdisciplinary approach. What's the value of interdisciplinary teaching and research? The advantage of being a broad business school is that we can provide and offer our students a much broader set of competences and also a much wider view of the world. The fact that we are also part of a, a big university enhances that advantage. However, and this is very important, truly interdisciplinary research requires that you master at least one of the disciplines. If not, interdisciplinarity becomes a fake or just a sign of bad quality. So what would you say is the unique perspective that students get from taking a broader view of business and society? To me, it's obvious that leaders in both business and the public uh, organizations must have a very broad set of competences within economics, law, politics, society, etc., etc. The globalized world is a very interdependent thing and the challenges are very complex. Hence, the leaders must have very broad and different skills than in order to operate in that environment. So when a typical student, perhaps a PhD, leaves Aarhus, what would you say they take with them from their time at the university? A, a mastering of at least one discipline and an experience to cooperate with people from other fields and also an open mind and a broad view of the world. At last but not least, and due to our research-based teaching, an ability to innovate and solve problems they have never seen before. Before becoming Dean, you had a distinguished professorial career in economics. So what's your take on the remarkable events we see unfolding in Europe and around the world? In my view, the world faces huge challenges, especially the Western world. We have to be back on the growth path in the short run in order to solve the long-term problems caused by demography, by climate change, by depletion of resources, by hunger, by lack of clean water, etc., etc. However, we have not been able to make a good start. Short-sightedness on the side of our business leaders and our polit polit political leaders have meant that we have not got in the right direction. Just look at the handling, the weak handling of the debt crisis, the tragic, comic but scary behavior of the American Congress, and the personal greed of important business leaders in situations which actually call for moderations on their part. So where do you see the School of Business and Social Sciences in, say, five years' time? Everything depends on whether we get our societies back on track. And I'm optimistic about that in the end. If that happens, I'm certain that the School of Business and Social Science, and for that matter, Aarhus University, fulfilling their mission of excellent research, innovative candidates, talent development, and knowledge exchange to the benefit of the global society. Sven Hulbert, thank you very much. Thank you.